Hi, I'm Elizabeth Abib. I'm 19 and I go to Texas A&M University. And this is my mural. I first heard about the Archdiocese contest through my art teacher, Ms. Harvard, and she encouraged all the people in my art class to design a mural and then like submit it. And I, I submitted my mural and I ended up winning and being involved in that. So it's really cool. My inspiration was the Eucharistic revival. So I wanted to visualize how Jesus's body and blood turns into the Eucharist. My reaction was pretty tame because I didn't realize how big of a deal it was. I didn't realize it was a big deal till I went and I painted it and people had to constantly tell me but after that was pretty exciting. So it was actually my sister Megan who uh, I would say like got me the job. They were having a meeting and she mentioned that I had done something like this before and so she showed my art to them and they ended up loving it and so I ended up getting to have this opportunity too which was super great and super cool. I really, I really struggled with the crown of thorns on Jesus' head and you can't see it from far away but when you get up close you can see that there's blood coming from the crowns piercing his head and I think an interesting thing about this mural is how gory it is. It's probably the goriest thing I've done, but that brings to reality the situation that like happened. And I think that it's really inspiring and it just shows Jesus' love for us and how much pain he went through. I hope it gives the, the Life Teen Kids something to focus on and brings to them the reality of the sacrament and like how true it is in a way that they can like understand better with the visualization of it and that it just brings life to the room because I like it's a great room but it's all gray and I just I think it's great that there's a mural in here now. So when I first came to St. Anthony's, I entered as a kindergartner and I went to St. Anthony's from kindergarten to eighth grade. So I'd been here nine years and I was involved in the altar serving community. So it's pretty close knit in this community. And it's just, I feel so great giving back to it and making my mark on here. Even though I like had spent so much time here, it's great to have a physical representation of my attachment to this community. So yeah, if you ever have time, if you're ever near the youth room, you should drop by and check it out. So I hope you enjoy it.